Alexis Gelber. I remember this phrase, uh, this sentence in one of in the Barnard catalog when I was applying to school, and it said, New York is Barnard's laboratory. My father had gone to Columbia. He was on the uh, faculty in the philosophy department for a number of years, and um, and so it felt it felt like a very kind of um, deep kind of generational sort of bond or something. I wanted to be a journalist, and I wasn't sure how to make this sort of segue to uh, mainstream journalism. And I wound up at Columbia um, at the J School where I felt that I had met my professional tribe. I had a fantastic class, a very, very, you know, diverse group of incredibly engaging, skeptical, questioning, funny people. There was a course that Fred Friendly and Benno Schmidt were teaching. Fred Friendly would go around the class and, you know, call on people and, you know, demand to know what you thought of something and he wouldn't let you go if you didn't give him, you know, a you know, straight answer. Throughout my career, whenever there were any kinds of issues of any sort of journalistic debate, I always heard the echoes of Fred Friendly and Benno Schmidt and my classmates. I was invited to chair um, a new alumni board and it was at a time when the journalism profession was kind of in crisis. Being a, an alum of Columbia Journalism School certainly is a way of feeling that um, I'm engaged in this conversation about the future of journalism. But I've also kind of um, availed myself of some of the continuing education programs because I feel like I have so much to learn right now myself. And I've taken Sri Srinivasan's um, social media uh, classes. My alumni involvement also makes me feel like I'm still learning. They will spread freedom and knowledge throughout the world. They will refuse to stand by silently. It reminded me of my J School graduation, and I uh, was so thrilled to see uh, the J School graduates in the stands. Um, so it, uh, it brought back a lot of very fond memories.